Good evening and thanks for joining us for News 5 at 6. I'm Kirsten Kwan. Nearly 100 years ago in Pound Gap, Virginia, the last documented lynching happened in the Commonwealth, a moment many don't know about. But as News 5's Andrew McClung shows us, community members are making sure that the day will never be forgotten. <laughs> Along the Kentucky-Virginia line, more than 50 people gathered to remember the lynching of Leonard Woods, the last documented one in Virginia. Woods was a black coal miner jailed for the alleged shooting death of a well-known man from Virginia. Following that man's funeral, a mob took Woods back across the state line in Virginia to be lynched. This lynching and the lynching of, of Raymond Byrd and Withful were the ones that got the attention of Governor Byrd. Over a thousand people viewed the body of Leonard Woods. Nobody was arrested, sort of energized to do something to make lynching a state crime in that that would be taken away from the lo local authorities to prosecute. We knew that Leonard Woods was a part of our history a bad part of our history. We were kind of undecided how we needed to record what happened. That was until about three years ago when Preston Mitchell and Tom Costas presented an idea to the Historical Society of Pound to place a historical marker at the location. And we talked about this, this lynching and how we thought it was eligible for a historic marker. And I was really uh, maybe a little pessimistic that we would ever see this day. But that day did come. It's not so much honoring L Leonard Woods as it is about just recognizing what happened and begin to reconcile from things like that. It's been undercover for so long and it was finally revealed. A moment in history that is now cemented in the ground at Pound. In Wise County, Andrew McClung, News 5, WCYB. Yeah.